uh, the blending sponge does not work if it's not wet. And you need to squeeze it underneath a salt faucet 13 times. Deal? Think about Mary Kay's favorite number, 13. We need to squeeze it 13 times to get that water in there. Deal? And squeeze it all out one last time. What you can do last minute is take the finishing spray and mist it all over the sponge as well. But know this. I want you to think about the sponge is like a stamp. It closes up to protect you. Um, it, when it's dry, it's dry because it can bounce around and hit things and not absorb bacteria. Sound good? It's to keep you safe. Uh, so the sponge gets wet and it expands. Um, that's why a dry sponge is so hard to squeeze. It's a pretty tough little dude if you've noticed. But if you get it wet, you squeeze it 13 times under the sink, then you get to see how flexible it is and how it can move and bounce all over the face. If you don't wet it, um, it will give you dry patches of stamped makeup that are almost cakey and unbelievably hard to blend. But if you get it wet properly and um, apply then, oh my gosh, girl, you will. It, it's a night and day application. I just want you to think that when it's dry, it's to keep you safe and in your makeup drawer. When it's wet, now it's ready for, to perform.